again as I promised I was going to do a video every single week uh, they are going to be mostly flip throughs uh, through my planners that I'm currently using but yesterday I got an order and it's a very special one so it's the one that I've been postponing for way too long and I finally decided to hit the purchase button and it arrived yesterday and I I, as you can see, I opened the box. The package was uh, involved in this paper. So, of course, I removed it. I did open the envelope and I looked at the content, but I did not open it, anything else. You are going to see what I'm going to see for the very first time, and this is not a trick. You're going to see that there's nothing written, there's nothing there. And I'm super, super excited to share it with you guys. Let's start with the package. It was my very first purchase with Nomado Store, which is a shop here in Belgium. And I was extremely impressed by their customer service because I had ordered one item they didn't have and they sent me a similar one, but the communication was very well done. And I have to say, unfortunately, this is something that I miss in many uh, shops here in Belgium online or not or even brands that's the communication that's uh, customer service and I was extremely delighted and not only their products are amazing the products that they sell are amazing so they probably got a frequent customer and that was my very first purchase with them and what did I purchase with them that's what I got from them together with my invoice I had this beautiful sticker so lovely this card with some of their products beautiful and an awesome thank you card with a message handwritten very very truly appreciated and look at this cutie oh so so awesome i really love the turtle so of course i'll be using it a lot <laughs> and it's very very attentive here is the product that they gave me a different one because I had ordered a small pen holder. Yes, I'm already giving you a hint about what I bought, but they did not have it anymore. And they sent me a medium one, but I'm as happy as with the other one. So no need to change it. And that's it. Yeah, you already guessed it probably. Yes, I got myself a Midori Traveler's Notebook. To be very clear about it, we still name them Midori. For example, mine, I don't know if there is any difference with new models, but there is still the address, the web address from Midori. However, this is not Midori anymore. You know, now it's Traveler's Company, but it's still the good and old Midori. And I got a black one. I'm so excited to open it. You have no idea. I have the pen holder and I got some refills. I got the zipper. I pretty much, it's my third traveler's notebook or traveler's journal uh, sort of planner. And I really like having those zipper pockets uh, in PVC. That's why I got it for this one too. I got uh, the blank pages, but with craft paper. This one I'll probably be using, you know, for memory recording images. I think, you know, it something about the color of the paper that you know gives that memory thing that memory feeling this one is with sketch paper of course uh, has to be with sketch paper because I'll probably be using it I didn't know I watched so many videos but I do not pay attention that the sketch paper is perforated which is also awesome very very good if you draw something and you want to scan afterwards that I was really happy about it. I also got extra bands, extra rubber bands, because as you can see, I, even though I haven't really decided my final, and probably my final is not going to be my final set, I thought it was a good idea to already get them in case I want to use more than two inserts. So that's why I got it as well. And I got the light paper refill. And this is the one I already know what I'll be using for. And this one is going to be for lists. But for example, spring cleaning is coming up. I've already started a little bit. 
but I want to have a sort of checklist that I can use over and over again every single year without having to copy or making it cumbersome some, somehow because I do have it electronically. But the thing is, sometimes I start my cleaning and uh, I haven't used my, my computer yet. My computer is not on. So I miss sometimes, I have time to do more stuff and sometimes I just don't do because I don't remember. It's not you know clear, have I done it, have, haven't I done? So that's why I thought I would rather have it on paper. And not only for that, for all general lists from recurring tasks that I can use a hard copy instead of only an electronic copy. I also got the craft paper folder. I loved the idea that I can store uh, receipts and other things or cards temporarily here until I get them in the final place because this traveler's notebook is probably going to be my EDC as well. At the moment, I'm using the traveler's journal from Prima Marketing, which is awesome, very beautiful, I love it. However, it's slightly heavy. The letter is very heavy and I have a lot of things already in there. It feels good. I can take it when I go somewhere for a longer time. But for every day, I start to think that I need to downsize or at least I need to have the option to downsize. Woohoo, let's open it together. As you can see, I haven't touched it. I just looked all the packages. I checked everything, but I haven't opened it yet. And I'm so excited about it. As I said, it was a purchase that I I thought, I looked, I read, I pinned. I did so many things before deciding it. And I finally pushed the button and I'm, I, I'm extremely excited about it. As usual, beautiful packaging. Of course, it's Japanese, Debbie, what do you want? It's beautiful. Just for the record, um, Traveler's Company is in Thailand. So the letter is from Thailand. However, the paper, some of the inserts, I'm not sure I checked all of them, but some of the inserts are with Midori paper. Uh, and it's, it's simply beautiful and it's meaningful. The reason why, even though I have already so many planners and I'm loving them all, I'm enjoying my Hobonichi really, really very much, my cousin. However, I'm in the moment of my life that I needed this option. It was, it was not just a choice, it was not a fancy choice. It was really a matter of needs. Going back to basis, there's a lot of going on my mind right now. And I needed that, I need that option. As you can see, the rubber is pretty much like the, the rubber from, from the Traveler's Notebook itself, which is amazing. And of course, like everyone else, I'll be using it because it already comes with an extra rubber. Oops, it's a lie. But I'll see if I use this one, but I'll surely, surely keep this one as well it's very easy you can just pull it out you see you have it that's very beautiful very beautiful packaging lots of information here you have information about the traveler's notebook itself here a lot of stuff in japanese which unfortunately i cannot read anymore i need to it's good it's good i put impression on myself to start japanese again <laughs> who knows if i look i want to read it i need to start my classes again now it's the moment that we all have been waiting for me for sure <laughs> this has arrived yesterday look how beautiful it is so probably that's what people talk about um there is a slightly some white powder but apparently if i'm not mistaken i read somewhere that has to do with the bag with the cotton bag but it's not extreme and the smell let me try it no, it's it's beautiful, beautiful smell. It's you see it just but pure brown. That's this leather life. If you don't like it, don't buy leather stuff. I see it's still here, Midori, made in Thailand. Ah, Jesus, it feels so amazing. I cannot explain that. Uh, it's very, very beautiful. So beautiful. It feels like I'm doing like everyone does. Now I understand why people are always like a loving showing love you see there's still a, uh, a mark here and it feels like very tight but 
it's not meant to look like this forever it's meant to be used i i don't want to to freak out about the cover of my my traveler's notebook it's really going to be my carry-on book so it's okay and it comes with one insert comes with one insert but if i'm not mistaken there are, yes there are two rubber bands see and that's why and let me show you there is also this page marker it's naughty yes there you are see so you can mark it some people put charms on it i don't think i'll be putting any charm it's it's really going to be simplistic very nice cover and the paper i love the paper see still midori and it's without lines chances are what i'll be using yeah so the pen holder i'll see if i can put it in the right place oops it's fallen already it's also a midori i don't know if i'm in the right place to show you and i think if i'm assassinating my yes i think it's like this oh i will look uh online and see if i'm doing something outrageous maybe i'm doing exactly the other way around i'll see i think so <laughs> it doesn't does not look right looks much better now okay so here it is i'll probably be using if i was going to use the small one i was just going to do like i do with my hobonichi and put the pen here but since it's it's a larger one see it fits very very nice my parker pen so that's probably what i'll be doing i'll see uh, i'm still thinking about it maybe i'll put a little bit lower that my parker pen is uh in the right place i'll see but yeah it feels awesome it's really 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 good let me remove it i'm still clumsy don't blame the the traveler's notebook that's me I'm, I can I tell you guys, I'm extremely excited about this purchase. It's something that's very, very meaningful to me, a lot more than just a planner. So for sure, the insert that I'll be using right now already, like uh, as of today, it's going to be this light paper here. The other ones, I already have some ideas, but they're not going to be for now. So just to show you how it looks like, with two inserts I am going going just to leave it out here and I'm going to put the second one in the smaller rubber see all this Japanese it's really for me to start studying again oh, oh, oh. oh this one is like this okay you see this one is already traveler's company if you look at this one this one was still midori and you see this one is already with traveler's company that's that's the new company right now uh, so uh, if you have a midori okay maybe you bought a midori like the traveler's notebook is the one that i own is still a midori but if you buy a traveler's company it's not like it's a fake one or whatever it's still midori it's just that the company has changed so midori is not involved in that brand anymore so here you go and it looks indeed a little bit different so probably that's why many people use uh differently because you can arrange the rubbers you have different methods here that they suggest I'll probably, as I read right now, I'll probably do something different. But that's probably going how it's going to be to start with. Eventually, because I, as I will be using the rubbers anyway, I might put the, the zipper case, I'll see. But I will show you as soon as I start working on it, using it, and maybe who knows our following flip through will be about my traveler's notebook i hope you liked it if you have any questions uh, as you can see i do have other notebooks that are in the style of a traveler's notebook but this is my very first let's call it midori uh, traveler's notebook if you have any questions feel free to ask or if you want me to show anything specific just let me know 
and I hope you enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe and leave your thumbs up if you like this video. And if you have any suggestions, questions, just drop me a line. I would love to hear from you. Talk to you next time. Thank you very much for stopping by. Bye-bye.